representing Czech Republic, Adam Andrew. Yes. Adam Andre. To any climbing fan, he needs little introduction. Widely considered to be the greatest climber on the planet, possibly the greatest of all time. Always fantastic to have him in the competitions. He's come and gone in the competitions down the years, and not too long from now. You can see that top hole beckoning. Rocks up the right hand lands, gets the toe up, gets the boulder. So out comes Adam Andre. Well, I must say it was definitely very, very enjoyable, especially here in Meiringen. I've actually never ever competed here and the crowd was amazing. And the ball problems, yeah, I, I think they were great. Harder and harder and harder on the left-hand side, but gets it done. Yeah, you can see the raw power of Adam Andre. Landed on that zone hold and it was clearly in the balance for a second. Now he's bearing down on that hold. Now that's an advantage of being tall, manages to get a nice knee bar. If there's a knee bar to be found, Adam will find it. This is a slap up with the left hand. Now he's just got to work the feet up. There's the top hold. There's the top from Adam Andre. And there's a big cheer from the crowd. They want to see him battling for the win on that fourth boulder. And they've got their wish. He's got the first two done. Both of them required a fight, but he ended up where he needed to. Now he's got the left palm down. Incredible flexibility. He's known for his flexibility, Adam Andre. He's known for just about every element of his climbing, apart from the parkour style and he put that flexibility to good use, trying to figure out how to use that half golf ball more accurately, more like trying to grip half a pool ball, no friction at all. But here he goes lining up for the top hole, he's got himself in position, at some stage he just has to commit and go for the big slap on the top hole. This is his first go, Adam Andre. The left hand lands, the right hand lands, he has flashed boulder three, he's kept himself firmly in the hunt and that's what it means. We said he was using the World Cups as preparation for qualification for the Olympics, but you can tell what it means to Adam Andre. But if Adam can latch the zone or the top, he will win the competition. I kind of feel sorry for the guys because of the crack. I, I of course, when I saw the crack in the observation, I was really psyched. At the same time, it, it is like making those guys look like a beginners because like crack climbing technique is, is not really complicated. It's just, you have to try and most of those guys have never ever hand jammed so it's really hard to show it when you, uh, to show it in the finals of the world cup he wants more than that he wants the top adam Andra lining it up finishes in style just needs to match that top hole there it is he is the best climber in the world and he is the winner here in my ring in 2019 the task was simple but not easy he needed a zone hold he got it, went straight through it and cruised to the top. Mike, what a moment. Adam Andre should be a script writer. I know I would not fall, that's for sure. Like, because at the same time, it looked like the hand jam was almost obligatory. And without a hand jam, it just looked really, really hard. And I was thinking like it could be a decisive bowler problem. And it, in the end it was. <laughs>